Hello darlings, welcome to a new vlog. As everyone say, I am f reporting to you, <laughs> vlogging at the shop right now. We'll now see the train passing by because we are very close to the train. So, uh, <laughs> that was epic, that was just a little thing. Anyway, hello and welcome back to you, to me. I didn't vlog for, what, few, few, few days, almost like a week and a half at least. And uh, I did have lots of ideas, especially on how to style those boots, but I'm just wearing them already. Anyway, quickly show you the outfit of the day. That's the, uh, the inside layer, because as you can imagine, it's coming up to the end of October and it's cold, it's chilly, even though right now in Montreux it's kind of sunny, I don't know if you can see. Yeah. A little bit of sun there, you see, so it's nice by the lake, but not, not on our street. Our street stays like this, nice and cool throughout, anyhow. So, here we are, nice background with cobalt. Anyway, as I told you, I'm at the shop and uh, I didn't vlog for a few days simply because I was kind of overwhelmed. I'm still overwhelmed, but um, it's getting better. Basically, I'm overwhelmed with the amount of things to do at the shop as well as at home because we're moving and also the fact that obviously there are new restrictions are coming in so i wanted to make a halloween party but it's not gonna happen at the shop so that's out of the window so just feeling like meh you know and um, right now i just went for a little um, run around Montra. it's afternoon but there is not much people on the streets and uh, i passed by most of the bars, restaurants, restaurants that are usually full for lunch, they're closed. Anyway, um, I'm working today. Yesterday we had uh, really good news. Um, we got the keys for the new house. So that's exciting, but I cannot show it to you just yet. Hopefully in this vlog. Anyway, there's lots to do, lots to move on with. And right now I'm at the shop. I'm using, this is my second bottle of Caudalie, uh, big shout out to Sashki and other people if you're interested to try this, this is called Eau de Beauté, so Eau de Beauté by Caudalie, I really, really, really like this right now. Anyway, I'm kind of happy I'm at the shop because it means that I can concentrate on uh, things that I can't control right now. Sorry, there's lots of train passing by. Look at this double decker. Can you see how exciting this? Wow. Swiss trains. Gorgeous. Gorgeous. As you can imagine, this is my view. A little bit noisy sometimes, but I just love that I can sit and watch the trains go by and people pass by. It's quite an active passage. Anyway. And sometimes I say hello to people, at least I look and smile. I look like, I know. So what I'm gonna do today, I'm gonna continue with drawing little plans for our apartment. Let me show you if I could. So I use this app, Notability. Luckily I learned it with my previous job. So this is this is the living room, the living space, and there's a top floor. Um, top floor, so you can see over here. A little bit of, there's a landing, sort of, there's a window. This will be ideal for like yoga, if you could imagine like have a big mat. I don't know if you can see this, but something peaceful. So yeah, something like a big mat over here and uh, when you wake up in the morning you can have the window here and the other window and like kind of do yoga anyway um, current idea for the garage so Jimmy will go here it's like double garage 
and this is the fridge so we thought that this would be nice you know something like this but currently I'm thinking this is not possible because of the lamp so our our wardrobe over here cannot go because of the lamp and Dominic today will measure because this is around two point it's around two meters but it's critical to get this height because I think this is gonna look cool and finally we can put our running machine here and the Rory machine and extra fridge so that could be very nice but we'll see anyway uh, current setup current ideas for the living room can you see this so we've got a nice massive terrace over here obviously this is going to be the dining table um, let me just put something because I would prefer it to be in a very nice um, in a nice wooden shape or I mean color at least material something more I preferably oval not that square like basically a big chunky country vibe style table rug our current sofa for now we're not gonna make any extra sofas anything big plant so that's so far that let me see if I can find anything else for you interesting to show uh, one of the guest rooms so yeah the guest room is gonna look like that you have a nice window so here the shutters are closed so you can't see the view but that's a big balcony and uh, you've got all the space here. so we'll nice keep it nice and simple and yep the same bed but we will change um, change the wooden frame so it's nice and stable so yeah that's so far it anything else some ideas for Dominic's room on the top floor can you see my room where is my room oh I'm gonna have my room can you imagine this so once again you can't really see because of my creative fantastic whatever it was but that's a big um, opening to the balcony I can't call it window and I cannot call it a door because it's like a big window door <laughs> so there it is and I'm thinking a big carpet in the middle nice table and some of my drawers we'll see I would like a proper rack so a proper clothes rack and this is my current makeup table that will go there so if you got any of this that's cool <laughs> so that was the little plans so far but I think it's gonna change a lot I think it's gonna change because we are new to this place and uh, we don't know yet how the lighting situation is where the plugs are for our comfort and uh, we're not taking a lot of our furniture because we just think that we need we need some more new fresh furniture like already got rid of the chairs that were so annoying my goodness music killed the chairs so not taking that anyway i'm gonna head to duties at the shop i do have some chores to do here just got my coffee from Cook Pronto. I'm supposed to bring my cups, but uh, yeah, anyway, don't want to discuss that. And they changed the time, so. Voila, I hope everyone is fine and um, I missed vlogging very much. Um, thank you so much for the new subscribers and also the old viewers that um, I can see and I can feel that you are up to date and you enjoy my vlog. So thanks for letting me know every time all right back back into the shop duty i need to make a new order for russian ukrainian things we need to order some british stuff over here is our little british uh for drawer side dish i mean what sideboard <laughs> as you can see tea taifu pg tips taylor's chocolates we've got nice tea as well taylor's you know I think we need to get some good herbal tea selection as well, but we do have an, um, a mountain, mountain work tea. So. Quickly, we'll show you my outfit of the day. Forgot. So obviously I brought my backpack, my oldie but goldie backpack, my 
lovely easy sunglasses they come with this felt felt case which is super easy and cool easy peasy as you can see i love the shape and they look awesome a mask of course i got it from the shop called sir in montreux put it on a little sheet like that that's the caudalie my phone uag the plants and the look of the day of course hold on so you get the whole picture of what i'm wearing today because this coat was um important because even though it looks like it's um it's okay outside actually it's a little bit nippy in the shadow wearing the bogner boots i don't know i feel like i look like one of those bolsheviks or revolution kind of people but i just couldn't be couldn't be bothered and i do have i do wear a layer under this okay just how people are not passing by and looking at me looking all dorky filming vlogs anyway. i've closed up the shop fully ready to go home and it was a lovely day we did have people passing by getting some bits and bobs which is always good and i made a new order and i just wanted to show you that incredible moon that i'm looking at hold on can you see that anyway the moon is coming out it's gonna be full moon coming weekend and it's time for me to go home train station mantra super quiet and it just turned six o'clock so it's gonna get busy but there's not much movement going on gonna be a massive full moon soon very very soon doesn't even want to focus so where are we at in there I'm at home as you can see and it's much later in the evening we had nice dinner with Dominic, watched some British telly, it's all good. And currently I'm getting ready to go to sleep. I'm just making my drink. You saw that's Restorate mixed with um, uh, Gallant Fit, which is for the joint health and cartilage. Anyway, I just need to take off my makeup. I don't have much, but still. And over here I'm currently like sorting what else what else can i take out as you can see if you follow our channel for a while that everything looks much much less in here and i'm prepping things i'm sorting so i'm gonna keep keep the pillows themselves but the pillowcases i'm kind of fed up with them so i'm basically gonna take it to a special recycling pot um, place as well as this candle um, shebang I mean some people do candles recycle and I've pretty much used up mine so I will take it to the place and if somebody wants to take those jars they will otherwise uh, they will dispose them properly at the dishetery also taking all of those carpets that's like uh, for fur which is synthetic and it did a good job over here to keep it cozy last winter I think it was an upgrade to this so that was really nice but it's time time to let them go as well as this carpet I can't look at it anymore Yuna loves it for some reason and also have some more carpet situation here so yeah this ones I will be taking later on I have one as well outside and my next point will be to take down finally those decorative pieces so i'll do that tomorrow because we don't need to have them hang here anymore 
So we're trying to have less things, as much less things as possible, so we can start cleaning and everything. So, yep. Good morning. Who's the cutest person with this pimple? I don't know what's going on. Anyway, I lose the train of thought when I see myself in the mirror, so I better put the viewfinder down. Anyway, as you've realized, I'm up and it's coming up. It's coming up now to 5.30. And I honestly don't know how I'm going to do this because because it's early and it's very dark outside it's like come on look at this i mean you, c you can see me but the street is like dark everything is dark so it's not very inspiring to do anything and it's very quiet so that's the current situation of this room i use it as my changing room and also trying to understand what clothes do I need right now because the weather is changing so I have here a little section prepped to take to the house hopefully today but it depends how I feel so yeah so far so good I'm just drinking my tea and uh, slowly but surely trying to be active but you know it doesn't work very much I didn't sleep I had like, a, I don't know, a very distant 20 minute snooze, it's not enough, so I will see how I feel because the sunrise is around, is it around 8 or 7? I need to check, see, now I'm confused. So I don't want to have a wasted day, but it happens to me. It happens to me sometimes, like every one month, every every second month, something like this happens. Anyway, talk to you later, guys, because this is just Savapa. Savapa. Oh, slippers. I need to get new slippers. These ones are just getting old. Abused, I'd say. is super exciting it's obviously later in the afternoon I managed to fill up Jimmy quite a bit with my clothes with some bits and bobs like the obvious the shoes the pair of shoes you know stuff like that even like little towels so I can put in the bathrooms and so on and now I'm gonna go and check out first time full with Jimmy Dominic already made uh, brought some things uh, yesterday with his mom so it's my turn and I'm super excited <laughs> Hello, hello, my god, it's so echoey in here, so cool, so nice. Actually, it's the next day and I've managed to bring more things in from the last trip. So I've got records here and also there are the records, as you can see, and also the pillows that I will be changing the pillowcases. 
I brought some glass, some champagne glass in a box like this. I brought some books. I brought Dominic's father's humidor for cigars. My tarot cards. Other bits and bobs here. And of course, new set of slippers for when we move in. Here's the corridor. That will be our room. I also brought soap and towels. Excuse the mess. I have a massive pimple. I can't show you myself in a close-up. Anyway, this doesn't matter. The exciting part is the soap is in and I brought our towels with Dominic. So D and M is already in and I've already been using. Um, that is that is potentially, not potentially, this will be our bedroom. So I'm gonna try and unbox the mattress with you. Anyway, epic fail with the mattress for a simple reason, it's the wrong plug. So this I think is European plug and the Swiss plug is thinner so, and it's got like three, three forks. So voila, this doesn't work. It's actually good that it doesn't work because Otherwise, I would have had crazy ideas and tell Dominic to sleep here tonight. Anyway, this is the room that I'd like to call mine. Okay. I brought some things, decorations, and also in this drawer, I already have my bags, my shoes, my trinkets, and I've also laid out those strips. So those like are fair, they smell really, really nice. So in the new wardrobes, because it smells of fresh paint, that I've placed this around. So it smells good. So voila, current update on the moving situation. And voila, for now it will be it, because uh, obviously we will be moving a lot of things, there is a lot of packing to do, and um, I probably will not be the most stylish person ever. You can already see I've started with the hair. What is this? My face today. Um, yeah. So that's the update. I hope you like the snippets of the new house. It's very echoey but we're very excited to slowly but surely bring in our things, furniture, clothes. It's, um, it's a process, but we've started already. I also, in one of the rooms here, this potentially will be another guest room. It's a nice big room. They're all about 13, 14 square meters, as you can see. Hope you don't get dizzy we will have to change lights and everything but it's got a nice drawer as well here anyway in this big drawer over here i already brought in my summer clothes some of the hanging things and i'm very happy about it so there is progress for sure